So I actually, that's uh, my that's second really part nice. was also very related to what, what he just suggested. Uh, so a different suggestion would be to, to you know, do not have to deal with uh, the assumption of a linear uh, fit to, uh, to take uh, each of the bins as weights to a weighted sum uh, in which you would calculate the distance from from your uh, you know the nearest to the sensor input. So there you, it would be just a number that does capture each of the bins and it doesn't assume a linear model. But it has to have the distance from the input because when, when doing it when you weight randomly then you don't get any result like that. It would be a weighted sum a weight the of the distances of each of those bins, right? So it would capture the, that distance as well. Okay, it, it's actually very similar to that. Yeah. Okay, are there more questions? Okay, thank you very much. Thank thank you. Thank you. So uh, there, is, uh, there are two panels in the afternoon. One is on uh, cutting edge neural networks research. And after that, uh, starting at 440, we have a HEP, uh, INNS HEP award special lecture by uh, Professor Henry Markram from EPFL. So that's 4, uh, 4.40 PM in this room. And then also the uh, 